Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Reseteer. So, um, the day in the game is Sunday. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday! And we're pretty much going to spend the entire day selling, but the first thing we want to do is get all this armor. Oh hey, I guess the, uh, no, it's outstanding orders, I want new summary. So food is decreased, which that sucks, because today we have a fucking order to get food, or to sell food. This game really doesn't like me right now, but, oh well, at least the price of metal has, uh, normalized. Uh, what is that? Uh, I kind of want Charm to buy that. So we're just going to put the survival knives up. Uh, and if we're lucky, she might even buy a survival knife, which would be fantastic. Uh, we don't want to sell the crafter's knife. Although we do. Okay. So I think that's everything. Uh, let's see if there's any events going on. There is something going on in the town square, but I'm terrified that it's the the grifter. Okay, so here we go. You weren't here the day I came to get my order. That's bad business. So they're mad. But I don't think it really has any negative effect. I mean, it might lower their affinity with us, but, you know, whatever. That's not a huge deal. Okay, this is kind of frustrating, because she's asking for this high-priced item, but if I suggest a high-priced item, she won't take it. That's some bullshit. You suck, little girl. Do you have my foodstuffs? I do have your foodstuffs. The only problem is, Everything is low price. Because. Fuck me, I guess. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and do this roast chicken. And fuck it, a ham sandwich. Because we won't take that big of a hit. Because we found those in the dungeon, so this is still profit anyway. I'll do 65? Ugh. Okay, 60, but that's as low as I'm going. I lost my combo. So awesome, Arma. Let's go a little bit higher. I mean, I know I said I normally like to stay under 10%, but I kind of really need the money. I can do that. I just need to get some really expensive treasures. Hmm. Okay, so that actually might have been... No, son of... No! Why would you do this to me, game? The price of long swords is decreased. Why do you hate me so much, game? Uh, I really kind of want to hang on to that cloth feeder, but I need the money. So everything we own that's expensive is going up. Armor's still really low, which is depressing. Uh, sand charm. No one's bought that other sand charm. Let's actually put one of these... ...up front. And we'll replace one of the purity rings. The magnet necklace. Necklace, the cloth capes. Okay. Mm, still just the town square, which I don't care about. No, although it is low price, so I can buy it for like 21%. Awesome. Good sir, are in luck. Uh, 
Hey, look, there's Tella. I'm looking for a weapon. How about this cloth beater? Ugh. Damn it! I should have recommended just the magician staff. See, that's what happens when you get greedy. I'm getting greedy and desperate. Because <laughs> I really need to make up that money. I have one of these pot stands. Stop selling me things. Buy things. No, I can't give you a little more for it. Breaking my combo. Trying to sell me low priced second hand food. Damn it, Louie. No, I don't have anything warm. Here, how about this old cape? in my balls game. <laughs> I didn't... Uh. Okay, let's try this again. We really need to make some money. We've only made like... Uh. Um. Here, take one of these survival knives. Stop selling me things. I don't want them. The point here is for me to make money. People are really getting on my nerves. Stop selling me crap. Oh, hey, look. Oh, really? You'll take that? Uh. Oh, thank God. I was really afraid she was going to reject that. Ooh, I got a new pin. I'm surprised as cheap as she is. Okay, we're about a quarter of the way there. Yes. Thank you, Fusions. You're saving my life. Mermaid shoes are so awesome. I love you, mermaid shoes. Awesome. Alright. Now, I would really... There's nothing going on in the town square. There should be something going on in the town square. Oh, well. I guess we're selling again. Put the longbow up. Ugh. I really wish this armor would go back to regular price. Ah, oh, damn it! I had a hand nip muffler. I could have sold that to Louie, but no. No. I had to be a moron. But I don't have anything warm, Louie. I'm dumb. That's actually quite a bit of people. Awesome. Ooh, I got a just pin. But still, it's quite a bit of money. All profit, baby. Why did I put a crafter's knife up? Oh well. It's still money that I need. Come on, everybody needs to buy something. Yes! Louie, you're so awesome, I take back every negative thing I've ever said about you. I don't want it. I don't want it, Charm. I'm definitely not paying a thousand percent for it. Uh, 
bum, bum. Awesome. Cool. So we're almost halfway there. We went from having... What was it? 20-something? Oh, that's a pretty good profit. Oh, yeah, it says it right there. We got 72,000 in profits. Um, what's going on? Oh, it's more of a uh, tell us storyline or tele tele. I wonder if the L's are silent. I wonder if Elvish is actually Spanish. That'd be pretty funny. I'd make her name Tia. I think that's right. I think that's right. I'm not... Men of character are currently seeking out worn swords. Well, that's just stupid. Why would I want... No. I mean, yeah, that's guaranteed it'll, that's guaranteed it'll come in. If I, if I get a bunch of worn swords and put them on display, it's guaranteed that a bunch of people will come in and buy them. Um, the problem with that is worn swords are... They're cheap. Garbage. Okay. So we have some choices. Uh, did the price of armor normalize? My store atmosphere is looking a little dark. Okay, so long swords, ah, uh, especially, yeah, especially since the, their price is low. I'm definitely not gonna do that. But, the price of armor has normalized? Think. Shit, so I can start putting a. Is that. Can you buy fur robes, or did I find that? I found that in the dungeon. So I'm assuming you can buy it. I'm gonna go ahead and put it up. Um, I'm always a little leery about putting up, um... Uh... Fusions. Because sometimes their parts are kind of hard to get. But... You know, it's not a huge deal. Okay, still so something going on in the town square, but I'm sure it's that grifter. I really don't want to talk to her. Uh, sure. A piece of armor, you say? Well, how about this fur robe? Awesome. I was afraid he wouldn't like me enough to buy it. Hey, look, it's Tia again. Of course you want food. Um, let's go with another ham sandwich. Yes, it's that much. I gotta stop offering her expensive shit. It's because I'm dumb. See, she lulls me into a false sense of security because she's like, oh, here. Because she bought that, like, $5,000 cape. And then she doesn't even want to buy a, uh, a $3,000 sandwich. See, I was smart that time because Kalu and I were not good enough friends for him to buy something really expensive from me. Just keep checking to see if there's anything going on out in the uh, out in the wide world. Oh no way! I had two big shields. All right. Alright. 
I think it's kind of funny how the cloth beater is a uh, a magician's staff. Well, at least he's selling it and not buying it. Of course, I wouldn't put up anything that was that that was low price. No, I can't. It is fucking low price. Fuck you, Louie. Low price is only getting 20%. Sorry. It's as high as I'm... No, it's as high as I'm willing to go. Sorry, I'm trying to sell low price shit. to sell me things. No, that's all you're getting for it. You're lucky you got that. Um, yeah. Even though that's a fusion, uh, money's more important right now. Okay, we did get a level up. And we can now change the counter. Ooh. Oh, we actually couldn't use vending machines yet when I was talking about them before. <laughs> Alright. Put the cloth robe up. Iron armband. Um, let's actually move this. I kind of want people to come in just for those. All of you better buy something. I don't want that. Alright, I'll go a little bit higher just because you're my bud, but don't go telling people. I wish she had, because you are a cheapo. Well, at least we got her to like us a little bit more. That's nice. Maybe we can start pushing it and make her buy things for 104% instead of 103. <sighs> Seriously, stop selling me things. Awesome. Keep buying stuff. I got a pretty good combo going here. Uh, and you're gonna make me break it, aren't you? I'll do 25. Yes. Come on, more people. No! Damn it! Ah, okay. The price of metal has decreased again because... Fuck me, that's why. Awesome, here we go. So this should be... Well, that was my cat, but... He's really talkative. Yay! This... is a douchebag. I mean... What's this all of a sudden? It's a demon. Yeah. This is Griff. Or... Griffith. Grimmith? No. Griff. I think is this gentleman's name. And he hates people. He hates people because he's a demon, and he's racist. 
Uh, but he hates Tyr even more. Uh, as you can probably tell from reading the thing, because I'm actually going through it pretty slowly. But yeah, so he hates Tyr. He hates all fairies that uh, make themselves servants to people. Hang on a sec. Yeah, so he leaves. So, in order to unlock the next section of the dungeon, we have to talk to this guy two times, I think is what it is? I think it's two times. Uh, so that's the first one, and he only shows up at the town square at midnight after you beat the Amber Garden. Um, and it's kind of the same thing with the Amber Garden, too. You have to run into, uh, uh, uh Tia. I'm gonna keep calling her Tia. I'm gonna pretend those L's are silent. You have to run into Tia in the, uh, in the town square, like when, when you, when that, when that scene pops up where she's looking for her sister. Um, that has to happen in order for the Amber Garden to open, because she's the boss of that. And going along with that theme, you have to run into Griff to get the next stage of the dungeon open, because he's the boss of that. He's also the next uh, adventurer that you have to get through the story. Well, not through the story, really. You actually don't really have to get any adventures through the story, because, you know... You don't have to progress that far, I guess. But, yeah. So, anyway, um, that should be the end of this episode. We did, we made um, some really good progress. Some really good progress. We have two days, technically three days, because we get the, the full day of the 29th to sell things to, our, to meet our deadline. Uh, so we're doing really good. Um, I really want to try to get the, the next level of the dungeon open, so... Um, for the next couple of days at midnight, I am going to be going to the town square to try to run into Griff, because in the next level of dungeon, um, you know, obviously it's going to have better equipment for us. But we also need to try to get our level up higher. So we're going to kind of be alternating back and forth. We're going to, you know, be doing, I don't know, we're going to be doing something. I, I, I have a game plan, but it's going to take too long to explain. Well, no, it's relatively simple, I guess, you know, collect more things and make fun Money. Anyway, uh, thank you very much for joining me. Thank you very much for watching, and join me next time on Let's Play Reseteer.